Hello and welcome back to the video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make a low calorie pizza. We're gonna be using um, flatbread. It's only 90 calories for one flatbread. 1.5 grams of fat, 22 grams of carbohydrates, 10 of which are fiber, seven grams of protein. Um, this one is a fit and active. Um, basically you can use any one if you can't find this one um, any one that's about 90 calories 100 calories as long as it has good fiber in it and a decent amount of protein and this will be your base so what you'll want to do is preheat your oven to 350 degrees place your flatbread on there Spray it with a little bit of nonstick, zero calorie. Flip it over, hit the other side. Then you'll want to put this in the oven for about five minutes, get it nice and crispy, and then you can start putting your toppings on there. So after you're going to be putting that in the oven, we're going to be using some low calorie pizza sauce. Um, this only has 20 calories, only 20 calories in this per serving. We're going to use one serving, which is a quarter of a cup or 61 grams. You have zero fat in this, four grams carbohydrates, one gram of fiber, and one gram of protein in this. And really any low calorie um, pizza sauce will do. I would try to stay under 50 calories for half a cup. And we're going to just use one serving of this. Then what you want is some low calorie fat free shredded cheese. Usually I would use mozzarella. Um, I'm out of the mozzarella right now, but usually I use mozzarella on there. I only have the reduced fat, which is 70 calories, because it still has four grams of fat in it. But if you get the fat-free mozzarella, you'll get 45 calories, zero grams of fat, and you'll have nine grams of protein. So basically, this is just all protein that'll be going onto your pizza. So I will be using the mild cheddar um, instead of the mozzarella, just keep it more low calorie but usually I would use fat-free mozzarella instead of cheddar. Now I did cook up some ground beef. I'm gonna use some ground, it's actually ground turkey, and I'm gonna use four ounces of this to add on there. So I'm gonna add a little bit of meat and a little bit of turkey pepperoni. So I'm just waiting for the flatbread to get a little bit crisp, take it out of the oven, and then we'll start adding the toppings. I just grabbed it out of the oven and it took about five minutes, uh, 350 degrees. Got it toasted up a little bit so it's a more of a thicker crust. Now I'm gonna add 61 grams of the pasta sauce. Sixty-one grams will fill up basically this whole flatbread. Gives you quite a bit of sauce to put on there. Leave a little bit of edge so you have like a little bit of a crust. So you don't want to go all the way to the edge. You can if you want, but I'll leave a little bit so I have some little bit of a crust there.
Next, I have some turkey pepperoni. It's gonna be lower calorie and fat. 15 slices is 100 calories, only six grams of fat, nine grams of protein in this. So I'm going to add, it's 30 grams for one serving or 15 slices of pepperoni. one left over so I put 16 on there after that you got your pepperoni sprinkle on some of this cheese 28 grams is one serving So a little bit over, went 30 grams. And then next up, I'll just add four ounces of ground beef. And then that will be my pizza. Now you can add any vegetables that you want. You can basically put anything you want on here. Um, but I'm trying to keep this more high protein and lower calorie. So I'm just going with like a meat lovers. Now I might not even need four ounces on here because that's already quite a bit of meat on there. So I might just do about three. So there's three ounces. That's a pretty uh, hefty amount of meat on there. After that, you'll take it, put it in the oven on 350 for about 10 to 15 minutes. Just check on it at about 10 minutes to your liking of how crisp that you want to get it. But 10 to 15 minutes should do you well. So there you go, guys. Just came out of the oven. 15 minutes, I cooked it. 350 degrees and if you made this exactly like I did it would be 388 calories for this whole thing so that's basically one slice of regular pizza it would come out to 33 grams of, of carbs that would be 33 grams of carbs 14.4 grams of fat and 42.5 grams of protein in this whole thing and out of the 33 grams of carbs you're actually getting 12 grams of fiber. So not a, a bad amount of fiber in this. And for 388 calories, it's not too bad considering one slice of pizza is probably gonna be around three to 350 calories. So you got quite a bit on there, make two of them. If you wanna make two, still be under 800 calories. So not too bad. And then you can put whatever you want on there. Add add some vegetables, add pineapple, 
add mushrooms, you know, anything to your content. But thank you guys for watching my video. Please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Hit that bell button, and you guys have a great day.